What's the difference between a workplace bully and working with somebody that's difficult? So if we look at workplace bullying, what was workplace bullying again? There are three things. Deliberate, Deliberate. Disrespectful. disrespectful, and repeated. Deliberate, disrespectful, and repeated, and it's always for the bully's gain. A difficult person, here's the difference, they may or may not be deliberate. And you know why? Because they're just trying to act out for their own needs to be met. They're thinking about, wow, oh, geez, I just want everybody to hear my story again. You know, when I was president in 1976. And uh, these people are going to stay here until I'm done that story. And if anybody leaves, I'm going to yell at them. Why? Because they want something for themselves. But a bully will say, gee, I'm going to deliberately leave this person out of the meeting, yell at them so they don't feel very good. And when they don't, I'll take that power for myself. And they've decided it. The difficult person is just acting out in order to have their own needs met. They haven't quite got it together. So then you say, well, how do I know? How do I know if it's deliberate? How do I know? Here's my best advice. And as we go throughout the rest of the session, my best advice is this. Put on some armor and be prepared for a fight. And be prepared, meaning they're not going to be kind. And go in and treat it as if it was a difficult person situation, meaning maybe we can talk about this. And if you get slammed, then you know, oops, I made the wrong decision. <laughs> and then proceed to treat it like a workplace bully. So with a difficult person, you can have a conversation and hopefully work something out. With a bully, you need an intervention.